And it was a bit of deja vu in downtown Sioux Falls tonight as attention focused on a building facade on the move. But it did not fall and no one was hurt. The episode is bringing up memories of a building collapse at that same intersection less than two years ago. On the night beat, Kelloland's Dan Santella brings you reaction from people to today's building problem. Dan? Sammy, something called a telelift is holding the facade above Vishnu Bunny tattoo and piercing in place. Mark Cotter, director of public works of the city of Sioux Falls, tells me that there was a real concern today that the facade of Vishnu Bunny might have fallen. Here's what different people I talked to today have to say about the scene. Amanda Johnson says today's concerns with this building's facade brought to mind the collapse at this same intersection. It certainly raised a little bit of rem um, remembrance of that and uh, thinking that. Hopefully, more of our buildings downtown are um, well um, built and are being well maintained so that something like that doesn't happen again. In December 2016, the Copper Lounge building collapsed on the northeast corner of this intersection, killing one person. Today was actually opening day for the new Lewis and Sanford locations on the same site. It, it is a little concerning down here in Sioux Falls after the, the collapse uh, a couple years ago that, you know, some of these buildings may, may not be structurally sound, okay. I suppose, but, uh, but no, I'm not too worried about it. Johnson isn't worried about going into these buildings downtown either. I haven't ever, and I don't think I'll carry that with me, but certainly, it, you know, seeing this today, it, it just, you know, raised a little bit of, um, raise an eyebrow to say, you know, are we, are these buildings constructed in a way that um, people are safe to be in them and frequenting them. Cotter says the scene right now is safe. All right. Thank you, Dan.